in this module we would consider lease to gift lease to gift is a valid contract in islamic law it is also known as ijara wa iqtina ijara wa iqtina can be and is actually used for islamic hire purchase the difference between ijara wa iqtina and ijara muntahiya bi tamlik is that in case of ijara wa iqtina the asset to be leased or the leased asset is actually gifted by the lessor to the lessee this is the technical difference between ijara muntahiya bi tamlik and ijara wa iqtina otherwise the end result of both these contracts is the same which is hire purchase in an islamic way however when we use gis gift as a component of ijara wa iqtina gift has its own implications for the transacting party in case of gift there is a peculiarity if someone says that i have given this thing as a gift to someone else wo gift us shakhs ke liye ho jata hai even if the person doesn't say that i have accepted it in case of sale contract ijab and qubool offer and acceptance are required in case of sale if i say i offer to sell this thing to you and you say that i accept it then the sale contract gets executed jaise nikah mein bhi aise hai ke ek taraf se ijab hota hai dusri taraf se qubool hota hai aur nikah ho gaya because nikah is uh, a contract which requires ijab wal qubool gift ki surat mein ye nahi hai gift ki surat mein ek hi party agar keh de ke maine fulan shakhs ko ye tohfa de diya to wo shakhs besha qubool kare ya na kare wo tohfa ho jata hai especially jab wo cheez jo tohfatan di gayi hai wo tohfa लेने वाले के कब्जे में आ जाए फिर तो बात पक्की हो गई इसलिए वेन एवर वी यूज इजारा व इख्तना इन इस्लामिक डीलिंग्स इस्लामिक फाइनेंशियल डीलिंग्स केयर मस्ट बी गिवन टू द फैक्ट दैट वंस एन इजारा व इख्तना कॉन्ट्रैक्ट हैज स्टार्टेड इट वुड हैव इम्प्लीकेशन फॉर द ट्रांसफर ऑफ ओनरशिप ऑफ द एसेट the uh, the lessee then has a right to own the asset at the end of the lease period ab maine jaise pehle kaha ki ijara muntahiya bi tamlik aur ijara wa iqtina mein technical differences hai lekin hota ye hai ki wo gift to diya ja raha hota hai लेकिन लेसोर एक्चुअली प्राइस को इन्फ्लेट कर सकता है कहने को वो गिफ्ट कर रहा है लेकिन वो रेंटल में लाइक इन इजारा मुंतहिया बि तमलीक रेंट कंपोनेंट होगा और प्राइस कंपोनेंट होगा एट द एंड ऑफ द पीरियड हाउ एवर इट एस्टेब्लिशिज अ राइट फॉर द लेसी टू ओन द एसेट इफ ऑल द ऑब्लिगेशन ऑफ द लीज कॉन्ट्रैक्ट have been fulfilled by the lessee there are some important considerations in a lease contract the most important one is the bindingness of this contract bindingness with respect to gift of course all the contracts once they have been executed they become binding but in case of ijara wa iqtina in some countries especially in countries like saudi arabia where this uh, uh, automatic ownership of transfer is recognized by the jurists 
a number of Islamic financial institutions are very careful to use ijara wa iqtina uh, in such jurisdictions. Now, an implication of this is that if the lessee has fulfilled all the requirements of the lease agreement, then the lessor will not have recourse to the asset at the end of the lease period. What does this mean? It means that the lessor will not have an option of changing their mind with respect to gifting. Gift ho chuka hoga or ownership change ho chuki hogi at the end of the lease period even if the lessor would like to change their mind. 